that. And so uh, you are also a, a very distinguished and veteran podcast host. And um, tell us a little bit about your podcast and what your focus is on that. Well, you know, again, this is another one of these things where success leaves clues. And there was a guy who um, is the one of the announcers for the Pac-12 Network. And he had come to me and said, hey, I want to do a podcast on you. And so he came over and, and we did this podcast. And, um, you know, I, I, was, I, was, I, was, I was spitting out these words like I'm doing to you right now. I had this little voice inside my head like, I think you can do this. And so fast forward the clock, he kind of gave me the keys to how to do a podcast. And, and so I launched this thing and 200 and I don't know, 50 episodes later, um, I, I have a, a wonderful podcast called finding your summit. And, and it's, it's about people overcoming adversity and finding their way. So getting back to that word of attitude of gratitude of really putting that perspective in, in that, you know, while things may go wrong in certain people's life and we all run into bumps, it's what you're going to do about it. Um, I've had the great fortune now of, of traveling all over the gro- globe, um, attacking these different mountains. And, and that's been the wonderful thing. And, and so going down to Tanzania um, or even Nepal, where the average wage is like $6,000 a year. And, and, and there's this correlation be, be, uh, behind the people with the least amount are the most happiest in those different cultures. And so, you know, to be uh, and have a podcast, as you know, Glenn, that takes a lot of discipline and chasing people around the block and scheduling and everything else. But every single time I get on, get have a guest on, it's so uplifting to hear their circumstance and how they work their way out of it.